Hello, welcome to Daily News from Marjaya TV. Commemoration of the martyrdom of the Holy Prophet and Imam Reza, peace be upon them, at the residence of Grand Ayatollah Shirazi in the holy city of Qom. For the third consecutive day, the residence of His Eminence Grand Ayatollah Sayyid Sadr Hussein Shirazi in the holy city of Qom held a ceremony commemorating the martyrdom of the Noble Prophet of Islam and the eighth shining star of the sky of MMA, Imam Reza, peace be upon them. Various groups of people, along with lovers of the Ahlul Bayt, religious scholars, cultural and religious activists, and students from Islamic seminaries attended this ceremony, which was held in the presence of the Grand Ayatollah Shirazi. Together with the reciters of the Ahlul Bayt, peace be upon them, they mourned the martyrdom of these two revered personalities. It is noteworthy that this ceremony was broadcast live on Merjaya TV Global Network, various satellite channels, TV boxes, and the Al Shirazi application. Condolences of Ayatollah Ashkevari to Grand Ayatollah Shirazi on the passing of Sayyid Ali Shirazi. Ayatollah Sayyid Ahmad Ashkevari visited the residence of Grand Ayatollah Sayyid Sara Hussaini Shirazi in the holy city of Qom. During this visit, Ayatollah Ashkevari extended his condolences to the Grand Ayatollah Shirazi on the passing of his eldest son Sayyid Ali Hussaini Shirazi. He prayed to the Almighty God to grant the deceased divine forgiveness and mercy. Hosseini morning ceremony held at the residence of Sayyid Ahmad Shirazi in Kuwait on the night of 27th of Safar 1446. Believers in Kuwait commemorated the days of grief and sorrow of the Ahlul Bayt peace be upon them by attending Hosseini morning ceremonies at the residence of Sayyid Ahmad Shirazi, the son of Grand Ayatollah Sayyid Sara Hosseini Shirazi. On the night of the 27th of Safar 1446, dozens of Hosseini mourners gathered at the residence of Sayyid Ahmad Shirazi to partake in the morning rituals. Guests from Saudi Arabia and Kuwait visit Grand Ayatollah Shirazi's office in Holy Kabbalah. The office of Grand Ayatollah Sayyid Sara Hussein Shirazi in the Holy City of Kabbalah welcomed guests from Saudi Arabia and Kuwait as part of his daily activities. These guests met separately with Shaykh Talib al-Salihi, the director of the Office of the Religious Authority, where they benefited from his advice on serving the Ahlul Bayt peace be upon them and the importance of religious and cultural activities. It is noteworthy that morning ceremonies continue to be held at the office of Grand Ayatollah Shirazi in the Holy City of Kabbalah in honor of the days of grief and sorrow of the Ahlul Bayt peace be upon them. Completion of the activities of the Baghdad Residence Morning Procession in Holy Karbala for Arbain 1446. The Baghdad Residence Morning Procession, affiliated with the Al Siddiq Fatima Center, a center connected to the religious authority in the city of Baghdad, provided services to the pilgrims of Imam Hussein, peace be upon him, during Arbain 1446. This procession offered lodging and rest areas in the holy city of Karbala and served warm meals to the Husseini pilgrims. The activities of this procession concluded after the completion of the Arbain pilgrimage. Commemoration of the martyrdom anniversary of the Prophet of Mercy, peace be upon him and his family, at the office of Grand Ayatollah Shirazi in Basra, Iraq. The office of Grand Ayatollah Sayyid Sara Husseini Shirazi in the city of Basra, Iraq, commemorated the martyrdom anniversary of the Holy Prophet of Islam, Prophet Muhammad peace be upon him and his family, with a morning ceremony. This ceremony, held on the 27th of Safar of this year, was attended by dozens of religious and cultural personalities, as well as general mourners. The speaker of this ceremony discussed the life of the noble Prophet of Islam, peace be upon him and his family. Morning ceremony for the martyrdom of Holy Prophet and Imam Reza, peace be upon them, at Grand Ayatollah Shiraz's office in Madagascar. The office of Grand Ayatollah Sayyid Sara Hussaini Shirazi in the city of Mahajanga in Madagascar held a grand morning ceremony in commemoration of the martyrdom anniversary of the seal of the messengers, Prophet Muhammad peace be upon him and his family, and Imam Reza peace be upon him. This ceremony, which took place on Sunday, was attended by dozens of Shia followers who mourned the oppression faced by the noble Prophet of Islam and the eighth Imam of the Shia. During this ceremony, more than 150 needy Shia families received food packages from the Office of the Religious Authority. Arbain procession held in the streets of Mahajanga Madagascar organized by the Office of Grand Ayatollah Shirazi. The Office of His Eminence Grand Ayatollah Sayyid Sara Husseini Shirazi in the city of Mahajanga in Madagascar organized the Arbain 1446 procession in the streets of this city. Dozens of Shia Muslims in Mahajanga city, predominantly youth, participated in this event, walking in the procession and performing morning rituals. 
Sheikh Mohammed Radi Al Wasram, the director of the Grand Jurist Office in the city, stated that the event was aimed at glorifying the symbols of the Husseiniyat and introducing Imam Hussein peace be upon him and his everlasting revolution to the people of Madagascar. Every year, followers of Grand Ayatollah Shirazi walk from the Saida Umul Bani Center to the office of the religious authority in the city on Arbain, performing morning rituals along the way. Commemoration of the martyrdom of Holy Prophet and Imam Hassan peace be upon them at Grand Ayatollah Shiraz's office in Mazar Sharif, Afghanistan. On the occasion of the martyrdom anniversary of the seal of the messengers, Prophet Muhammad peace be upon him and his family, and Imam Hassan al Mushtaba peace be upon him, a grand ceremony was held by the office of Grand Ayatollah Sayyid Sadr Hussein Shirazi in the city of Mazar Sharif in Afghanistan. This ceremony witnessed the passionate participation of religious and cultural personalities as well as general mourners. The speaker of this ceremony elaborated on the life and conduct of the Holy Prophet of Islam and Imam Hassan peace be upon them both. The Najaf Center for Strategic Studies hosts Nabawi mourners. The Najaf Center for Strategic Studies NCSS, a center associated with the religious authority in the holy city of Najaf, hosted mourners commemorating the martyrdom of the noble Prophet of Islam, may God's peace and blessings be upon him and his family. On the night of the martyrdom of the Holy Prophet of Islam, this center set up a mourning tent to serve the mourners. During the Arbain of this year, the Najaf Center for Strategic Studies also implemented several activities in line with the recommendations of the religious authority, Grand Ayatollah Sayyid Sara Hussein Shirazi, focusing on the necessity of providing cultural and welfare services to the pilgrims of Imam Hussein, peace be upon him. <laughs> 